I've successfully turned pumpkins into armor. I'm not sure what value they actually have as armor, but at least I taste delicious in a pie. That's all I got. I'm Kindly Keard and welcome back to Minecraft. As you can see, I'm a man made of pumpkin. This is the turn anything into armor mod for Minecraft. It's actually called Extra Armor and it allows you to turn just about any material in the game into something you can wear like pumpkin. Now, some of the armor sets actually have bonuses. I don't know if pumpkin has a has a bonus for you, but on the bright side, I could hide, you know, next to a pumpkin patch and no one would know. It's me. I'm a pumpkin, but I'm going to give myself a whole bunch of materials and we're going to see what we can actually turn into wearable armor. This is going to be exciting and weird. So right now I'm in creative mode. I'm just going to give myself some different types of materials, like uh, like different types of wood. I, I think that you can make armor pieces from the actual wood. I don't know if you make them from the planks or the wood. I'll make sure I give myself enough. Acacia. That'd be weird. Wouldn't that be kind of orange? I don't know. We'll find out. Oh, watermelon. Yes. Yes. Give me watermelon. This seems dumb. Armor made out of cactus. Let's see if we can make that happen. Oh gosh, it's very dark. I'm still in creative mode, so I can make it daytime. But I want to legitimately test the armor. So here we go. We've got ourselves a crafting table. Um, I don't know what the recipes are, but like, hmm, maybe you do it with planks. Let's see. Let's turn some of this wood into planks. Let's see. Let's do a helmet. Oh! <laughs> Oh, what? Oak wood helmet plus one armor. There you go. Okay, sure. Pants, let's go. I don't know how to make other stuff. We got ourselves some shoes. Beautiful. And of course, our chest piece. Boom. I am very, very concerned about splinters. Now, how does this stuff compare to my pumpkin gear? It's actually worse than my pumpkin gear, which kind of makes sense because pumpkin is a much harder material to come by than wood. But at the same time, I feel like wood is much harder than pumpkin. I really want to see the acacia one. So let's make some acacia planks because this is going to be like orange, which seems kind of weird. Yeah. Oh, I like this helmet. Yes, please. Body armor. Okay. Then give me some pants. Beautiful. Incredibly uncomfortable, but very cool looking. <laughs> I gotta say, very, very cool looking. Oh, this is crazy. This is a crazy mod. I'm excited to see what we're gonna make. Um, we've got to try the watermelon, right? Let's go back to our crafting table and let's see what we got. All right. Is 30 enough for all the armor pieces? I guess we're about to find out. No. Oh, I'm so sad. Wait, 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 wait. You can turn melon into watermelon slices, right? And you get melon slices just by punching watermelon. Is that right? I got to go into survival mode. I'm scared, but I'm going to do it. Okay, so we punch the melons and we actually get some watermelon. Now, this could be the material that you actually need to make armor. Although I'd much rather make armor out of entire watermelons than just slices of watermelon. But listen, I'm not the expert here. I'm just figuring it out as I go. Okay, let's see if we can make something out of this. Here we go. Pants. Give me watermelon. Pants. Let's go. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it actually worked. Oh, that's incredible. Melon leggings. Okay, there's my watermelon helmet. It's beautiful. Let's get some watermelon shoes. I'm not gonna lie. These would be real sticky, like gross sticky, especially after you wear them. Oh my gosh, just disgusting, but also awesome. I got way too much armor in my inventory. Melon me, let's go. Oh my gosh, the watermelon helmet. You know how they use watermelons as like a helmet test for like your brain? if you're not wearing a helmet and you get into some kind of accident. So if you turn a watermelon into a helmet, feel like it's not going to protect your head the same way that the watermelon in the actual helmet test does not turn out good when it gets dropped. But I mean, there you go. I am a man made of watermelon and it is a thing of beauty. But now I want to be a man made of cactus. So we can't actually plant the cactus because we need sand. Here, 
Give me sand. Okay, can we plant it here? Yes. Yes, we can. Now, I have a feeling that cactus is gonna work the same way as melon, but also very, very spiky. Oh my god, it's gonna be so uncomfortable. Oh, this is such a terrible idea. Oh, I forgot. Cactus doesn't break up into pieces, does it? It's literally just a block. Okay, good to know. Let's go back to our crafting table and let's see if we can turn this into the world's most uncomfortable clothing. But also, maybe it makes us like spiky. So if like things walk into us, we hurt them. I don't know. Let's see. Give me pants. Oh my gosh. Hold shift for more information. These thorns should make foes think twice before attacking. You know what? That might actually mean that we become a very pokey dude. And I am super into that. Give me some shoes. Give me the world's most uncomfortable shoes. Oh my gosh. It's glorious. For the record, it seems like you need 24 pieces of whatever you're making armor out of, which you guys probably already knew, but I am just learning. It's nighttime and I'm scared, so I'm going to make it creative mode again. And I'm also going to make it daytime again. I'm also going to change the weather. Make it clear, man. I don't want rain. Could you imagine what this armor would do in the rain? Probably start disintegrating. Nobody wants that. But what we do want is we want to put on spiky cactus armor, which looks really similar to the watermelon armor, but I hope that it functions different. Oh my gosh, we're glowing. Thorns won. There you go. That, I mean, you know, that makes perfect sense. Come here, chicken. Do you fear me? You should. You should fear me. It, uh, you're not getting poked. Maybe because I'm in creative mode. Let's try survival. Face me, chicken. Okay, thorns don't work exactly the way that I kind of expected them. You know what? They probably have to attack you in order to take damage. That's probably the way thorns work, huh? I've never really used the thorns enchantment in Minecraft, but it seems pretty cool. And now I'm a dude made of thorns, and that is super cool. But I think we should clear our inventory here because we've got a lot lot of stuff that we don't need anymore. And let's try some even crazier recipes. I want to try some really weird materials. Like, what do you think of honeycomb? You think we can make armor out of the same stuff that bees build their hives out of? Will that make me lord of all bees? I really got to know. There's other crazy blocks too, though. There's like blocks that come from the nether, like quartz, quartz armor or emerald armor, right? Oh man. Okay. Let's pick out some blocks. Sponge? Can I be SpongeBob? I'm gonna try. Glowstone. That seems like a cool one. Let's give it a shot. 24. I hope my math... Ow, I just bit my tongue. I hope my math checks out on that. Prismarine. Yes. Yes. Let's try that. Magma block. Uh-huh. I'm gonna be a man made of lava and I'm okay with that. What is black stone? I don't even know what that is. That must be in a more recent update. We'll try it, but I don't know if this mod supports this new of stuff. I, I really don't know. I've made it to the stone age, apparently. Where's my honeycomb at? Honeycomb, there you are. Welcome to the party. What the heck is this, a stone cutter? This is all stuff that I have never used before. A smoker, a blast furnace, oh my gosh. Okay, okay, I think that's enough for now, for now. I would like the weather to be clear, and I would also like it to be daytime again. Thank you. Let's become SpongeBob or at least try. Please sponge me. No! SpongeBob doesn't work. Really? We can't be a sponge person. Imagine how easy it would make cleaning. Throw some soap on the floor and just flop around. It's incredible. Your floors are clean. Spick and span in no time. Okay, I'm a little sad about that. Let's try glowstone. Glowstone? No? But wait, wait. Glowstone becomes something else. These are the actual blocks. But can we put glowstone down? Does glowstone? Yeah, okay. And then if you if you break it, it becomes something. Like glowstone shards or something, right? So let's place some glowstone down and then we'll break all this glowstone, but we have to be in survival, I think. Let's see. Yes. Give me the shards or the, the dust. I need 24 dust. I have 24 dust. Okay. Let's see if we can make armor out of this. Come on. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is awesome. Also plus five armor and you probably glow shines brightly illuminating the sky around you. Oh my goodness. We need to find like a dark cave. Okay, hook me up with a full set of glowstone armor and let's find ourselves the darkest of caves. That looks so cool. <laughs> I have night vision. So it gives me night vision. Now, I don't know if it like makes me glow, but it allows me to see in the dark. So there is that. 
Um, I think there's a cave right here. I'm a little scared though, because I don't have any weapons. Also, does this mod only give you armor or does it give you weapons? I don't have the materials to find out, so I'm just, I'm just gonna wing it. I'm going in. Oh, there's, oh no, we're gonna die in here. I'll just switch to creative mode if things get real ugly. You know what? I'm gonna switch to creative mode now so that I can just dig. Let's go. Oh dear, I punched through the bedrock. Um, my bad. But as you can imagine, uh, it's probably pretty dark down here. <laughs> but we can see totally fine. My question is, though, like, do I light up the world around me? If people saw me, would they say, Kian, you're glowing? And I'd say, thank you. I moisturize every day. Also, I'm wearing armor that's made out of glowing rocks. Let's just see. I I I've made myself, like, a little mine. Um, it's actually really hard to tell. Maybe if I take one piece off. Okay, the night vision is going away, as you can see. And it is gone. And I am in complete darkness. So it doesn't actually glow, it just allows me to see in the dark, which is a little disappointing, honestly, but I, I understand it's probably a little bit harder to do. Let's try making some more crazy stuff. I think prismarine works the same way as glowstone. I think it becomes like a powder. Yeah, so we need to break it up. And I probably need a pickaxe for that. I'm just gonna give myself a diamond pickaxe and then we'll switch back to survival. Then we will break these blocks. Nope, they just become blocks? Huh, and that definitely didn't work. No pants. Well, that's disappointing. This is the most it's ever rained while I'm making a video in Minecraft. Why you insist on raining, Minecraft? Very rude. Let's make some more cool stuff. Let's become bee king. Maybe? No. Ah, but, but wait for it. Wait for it. Maybe if you place the blocks and then you punch them, you get the same thing back. <laughs> How do you get honeycomb? You have to use a pickaxe? No, that just gives me the block. Okay, so I cheated. I went into creative mode and I just gave myself honeycomb because I don't know how to get honeycomb. I'm a noob. What can I say? But I'm hoping that this will work. Maybe? Yes! Yes! Honeycomb legging! <laughs> Let's go. What does this do? If I'm wearing a full set of armor made out of honeycomb, what kind of power is this going to give me? I guess we're about to find out. It honestly doesn't seem that good, but let's let's see. Let's see what happens. Anything? Like no bonuses? Nothing? Don't just armor? I'm not king of the bees? Come to me, bees! I am your ruler! Or not? I guess not. Okay, that's disappointing. You know what? I'm gonna spawn some bees and just see how they react to me as their king. Okay, I have some bee spawn eggs. Um, I'm just gonna spawn all of them. I'm also in survival mode, so I'm hoping that they react like naturally. Um, hello? I am made of honeycomb. Is this what bees normally do? <laughs> They're not swarming around me. Wait, wait, I'm pretty sure that bee just like licked me, which is a weird thing to say, but I'm, I'm pretty sure. Hello, hello, I'm, I'm wearing honeycomb. I don't know if you guys noticed. Um, what, what, what is happening? These bees are not giving me the attention that I feel like I deserve as their king and ruler. I'm wearing your house. They don't care. That hurts. All right, let's make magma armor. It totally works. Oh my gosh. This is going to be one of the coolest things that we've ever seen. Right? Right? <laughs> this is cool. Does it do anything? It doesn't seem like it really does anything, though. Like, I mean, it has good armor, but it doesn't seem like it has any kind of benefits, which is honestly very disappointing because I'm wearing lava. How much cooler can you get than that? I mean, look at me. Very hot. Just incredibly uncomfortable. But I look awesome. It does nothing for you. It just gives you armor. That is so sad. All right, fine. And then the last material that we have is this black stone and it doesn't appear to work, which doesn't entirely surprise me because I don't know what Blackstone is. All right, well, I have a nice little surprise for you guys. I found the extra armor menu. It was here the whole time. I'm just dumb. But now we have access to every single piece of armor uh, already made. So like obsidian, crying obsidian. What, what is crying obsidian? <laughs> That seems awesome, though. I, I want it. Give it to me. Yes. It gives you armor toughness and knockback resistance. It looks insane. But it looks like there's also prismarine. Prismarine shard and prismarine crystal. What's the difference? I don't know. Let's go with crystal because it sounds cooler. Oh, you can totally do emerald. That seems cool. Oh, look, it's raining yet again. Who cares? I'm putting on my emerald armor because that seems awesome. I'm entirely green. Does it do anything for you? Yo, it gives you luck too. Okay, that's awesome. <laughs> 
<laughs> I would hate if it broke though. If I feel real bad if my my cool new emerald armor broke. Where are the stats on this thing? It's actually pretty good. Yeah. Well, let's see. Prismarine crystal seems awesome. What is dolphin's grace? What is this? Can I swim like a dolphin? Tell me I can swim like a dolphin. I'm going in the water. I'm going to dolphin. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at how fast I am. This is insane. <laughs> What the heck? Look at me move through this water like it's nothing. That's amazing. I love this armor. It's so cool. Okay, okay. Yeah, I think I've already mentioned it, but this mod's really cool. And then crying obsidian. What is this gonna do? It looks insane. I'm now glowing. Um, what what'd you do to me though? Why am I glowing? Blast protection. Yeah, that's good. Also, that horse just got struck by lightning right in front of me. I'm so sorry. So sorry, Mr. Horse. All right, there's one more armor set that I really, really want to try. Ender. Oh, yes. Let's go. So I assume that you have to make these out of Eyes of Ender, which seems insane to actually have to make them. But I bet it's worth it because it looks insane. What does it do? I don't know. Let's find out. I'm an Enderman. Am I? Wait, what is that? What does that mean? Speed. I'm fast. Oh, I'm so fast. Let me go. I'm so zippy. Move aside, Enderman. I'm now the fastest creature on the planet. Probably not. But I mean, that's that is pretty cool. Is it good armor, though? Eh, it's all right. But it does make you really fast. So, you know, that's pretty cool. Oh, good. It finally stopped raining. Don't worry. Give it like two or three minutes. It'll start raining again. Don't worry. But look how awesome I am. Oh my gosh. This was cool. Just want to double check though. There are no weapons. So it is just armor. I would love to see if they could apply some weapons or tools with kind of the same ideas. That would be pretty cool. Either way, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.